Backstreets with Coach shit, man. I appreciate y'all rocking with me on this video series. They came through with the gas, man. Big Backstreet shit. Let everybody know who y'all is, where y'all from, and what y'all got coming. What's cracking? What's good? Hey, man, my name is Dejash the Real. We are FWIS. You feel me? Mm -hmm. And uh, we from Houston, Texas, man. It's hot inside. You're from this one. Hey, I'm okay. okay. You're. Yo. I'm more individually. I'm young dude from yep. South Park. Yep. 19 years old. Yeah. YG Fall Train, dead end. Okay. Maybe 20. So what? Yeah. Definitely, definitely. Oh, I'm 28. I'm sorry for you. No, y'all got it. Y'all made me see It's all good. It's all good, man. How did y'all meet, man? How did the group, uh, how did it come about? Oh, uh, well, okay. So I met both of them throughout the band, basically. So he, he went to Madhouse. You feel me? I met him because. Speak. You feel me? Hear me? Oh, uh, I met him because we ended up doing the Sensational Sounds in uh, high school. Okay. So from then, me and him got cool. I met him also through high school when I used to go back and help work the high school out with a band. So I met him there. And from there, man, it was just like, shit, let's do some music. I heard his voice, actually, because he sings and rap as well. Mm -hmm. So I heard his voice, and I was like, bro, you can really do something with your voice. Like, for real, for real, let's make some music. And boom. That's how it happened with him. Man. Then when Funk Train, shit, same thing, man. Ain't nobody really believing, bro. Ain't nobody man. believing, bro. Why come? Come to this home, man. Look, it's a long story, but I'm here. We here, we here, man, y'all. My yeah, homie looked out, we. Yeah. Well, yeah, this is what it's for because you're an artist, but we got to give your story to the world. Everybody got a story, yeah. but you know why people ain't believing? It's good to have a homie and people. To mm -hmm. believe in your, cause sometimes you ain't, it ain't gonna be your family and friends. Sometimes it's gonna be strangers, but yeah. you ain't had that push that friends for the music or what was it? Shit, it was really financially, you feel mm -hmm. me? See, niggas, they was trying to fuck with the niggas that was already on top and like I was trying to get to the money. See, I was like at the bottom. Hey, man, talk about the new song that y'all got out. Hey, it's a one, two, three. It's a one, two, two three. You hear me? Hey man, I ain't gonna lie to you. We just we just recently dropped this like a couple Stop of days ago. Stop it. No, yeah, we just recently count. dropped it a couple of days ago. You feel me? And uh, I ain't gonna lie, all of the exposure that we get for the hoes kind of like, damn, that's what's up. You know, really, really people really fucking with it. And it was really awesome. Let's just do this hoe to put something off right now because yeah. we're coming out with a group repeat. You feel mm -hmm. me? Real soon. It's called, yeah. it's called a takeover. So man, let's you know what go. we gotta do right now. Takeover, man. What made y'all say it's gonna be there? What y'all saying shit up this year? Man, what, what that about? What's that about? It's our year. You're, you feel me? It's our year. Fuck you're, what you said. I'm on my shit. You're, you feel me? It's right here. Fuck what you said. I'm on my shit. You feel me? Yeah, yeah. I'm working on everything. Man, yeah. I'm man nah, for shit, y'all. For shit, y'all, man. We really feel like we just, we just ready to take over, man. We've been quiet for too long, to be honest with you. Man, on the cool man, if you don't see too many groups doing their thing in Houston and keeping that shit alive, man, what set y'all apart from everybody in the city? I feel like we got hard work and we got dedication. We got patience. You feel me? A lot of people don't got patience. A lot of people don't got hard work and dedication like they say they do. You feel me? I take my time with shit. I no, you don't got to force it. No, my mama. And my mama, you don't got to force it. When you force it, uh, shit ain't going to go your way. I ain't gonna say no names or nothing, but like, obviously we see people out right here that, you know what I'm saying, people talk about the word consistency, mm -hmm. and then they always just drop and drop and drop and drop. Yeah. And like, and then I, I say that, but I ain't going nowhere, you know what I'm saying? Like, so, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, literally, some people just keep, they just keep dropping and dropping and shit, and like, ain't going nowhere, like, and I was just like, man, I ain't I don't wanna do that like Right. Like I wanna if anything I wanna take my time. Yeah. Cause like when you take your time, everything gonna fall in place, you feel me? Like a nigga don't gotta be dropping. So you trying to pace it. Yeah, you mm -hmm. know, just don't force it. I feel that. You I can't feel rush that. the vibe. I feel that. Man, what's some advice that y'all give to these artists, man, in the city? Man, hey, if you want it, strive for it, man. Hey, never give up, bro. I'm gonna tell you like my cousin tell me. He, he strive a nation. Hey man, strive for whatever you need to. Oh, my mama, if you got, if you, if you ain't got that much bread, like, like for real, like, nah, for real. Bro, my mama, like, you ain't got that much bread, stack your shit up. If you got a house target. Hard rappers, do you feel like you guys are targets? When you nah. at a certain level. Nah. Well, yeah, okay. I get to a certain level. You said nah. I said nah, because we ain't really just up there. We just, we right. a lot of y'all get took out. Look at last year, Mo 3, huh? You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. No, I get what you're saying. 
I ain't, that's why I'm but saying we got all this level. Shit, and he was really in the streets as so, far as like, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro was really in the streets. But, yeah, and then people, but people still, some people drop out. Some people die for no reason. Yeah, yeah, I write about that, man. I ain't nigga on that. Man, last meal on death row, what would it be? Mm. Should I hear? Last meal on death row. <laughs> what? What? I had to wait, what? <laughs> So basically, you saying if I could pick anything to eat. Yeah, cause it's like. Oh shit. See, hold on. I ain't gonna lie, I'm going with Timmy Chan. I was gonna say that. <laughs> I'm gone. I was gonna say that. Hey, I was gonna say that. Nah, you hear me? Talk about for sure, bag a little bit. That's a bad motherfucker. Ooh. Yeah, that's a bad motherfucker. Bag a little bit. Bag a little bit. That's a bad motherfucker. Hey, for sure, bag. It really just came from. I was tired of everybody saying. Secure the bag. Mm. I was tired of it. I was like, man, fuck all that. It ain't secure if it ain't for sure. You feel me? If your bag is for sure, then that hoe is definitely secure. So I was like, fuck it. I want a name for sure bag. One of my partners, I posted it on Instagram. I think I'm gonna name my song for sure bag. One of my pop was like, it's called uh, Secure the Bag. And I was like, nah, it's for sure. Like, it gotta be. It gotta be for sure in order for you to get it. Regardless. So for sure bag. One of my partners, I posted it on Instagram. I think I'm gonna name my song. She put y'all back when my papa was like, it's called uh security bag. And I was like, nah, it's for sure. Like, it gotta be, it gotta be for sure in order for you to get it regardless. So that's how I feel. Like for sure bag. So boom, video came from there. And I just wanted to do like a quick little uh, skit in the beginning. So I had my my female friend, you feel me? OG, oh I'm sorry, not OG, I apologize. Princess, Princess Bree. You feel me? She another new hot artist out. I had her do a skit in the beginning. That's when you booty butt cheeks. That was my nigga. Okay. Boom. That's how I... What was the influence behind? Mmm. Nah, I just... I, I guess I wanted to show rappers that you can make a fun video instead of talking about I got racks and you got money piled up to your motherfucking arm and shit. I just felt like do a fun video. So we was throwing water at our barbecue. We was eating chicken. Eating chicken. I mean, I wasn't there. Yeah, he wasn't there. This time. On as hell, man. What's, <laughs> what's next for the whole group? What can the streets expect from you guys? Oh, y'all can expect a video of the Whistle 1, 2, 3 coming out March. March, I'm sorry. We shooting in March 2nd. Yeah. So y'all can, y'all can, y'all can look forward to an EP. You feel me from the group? The takeover. The takeover, you feel me? FWS, the takeover, and I kept. Um, individually, we got music individually as artists as well. You feel me? I'm the Jazz to Real, the Young Goose, you know what I'm saying? YG Funk Train. We also have music individually, but we still do music as a group, man. We just got this EP, seven songs, and I hope y'all like it. I hope y'all fuck with it. Yes, sir. I ain't gonna lie, it's, it's gonna be some pressure. Well, y'all like what's the yeah. one and three? Well, <laughs> That whole just angry. It was just like one night we was just smoking, bro, and we was just going through beats, and that bitch popped on. We just <laughs> <laughs> it was like funny. We just go right to that bitch and shit. So we came out with the first. I came out with the second one. Bro, and then him. That nigga, that nigga's a guy's oh, writer, nigga. bro. Hey, I said what you did, fuck. Did something stuck? Hey, man. Hey, it was like, like it was like, like yo. Yeah. Yeah, like that bitch. See, cause he rap, he. I, I, I get old school, but I get old school. There you go. I mean, he get with an old soul, you feel me? Like, yeah. my first song was like kind of old school, call it Monet. Mm -hmm. so, mm -hmm. That's when the band was jumping. And you was, y'all was in the, y'all was in the band? Or? Yeah. In, in what the instrument y'all played? Little I was, was cymbals and tenor drum. I played snare. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, man, y'all. That's the hit telling me. Yeah. So y'all just said, like, man, this dope. What got y'all into that? Y'all just born with it. Just love music. I mean, yeah, yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Yeah, that, and yeah, loving the yeah. love of music, no cap. Yeah. You know, you seen them when you love it, you like, I want to be in that. Uh -huh. I, I got to hit that drum song. Nah, it was, when you love it. was different. When I was a baby. I used to just be on the pots every Sunday. My mom would yeah. <laughs> have church in the house. I swear to God, I used to get the spoons, get the pots, get the pans. I used to set it up myself, my smell. My <laughs> my nah, for real, for real. <laughs> for real. Do y'all got a dream collab or anybody that did a lot you want to work with? Dead Mo 3. Yeah. I'm sorry. Fine, I'm I just. Dead. That nigga be. Yeah, that's Dead is Mo 3 alive. Man, I ain't gonna lie, Chris Brown. Ooh, good one. I like that. Everybody say gangsters, I want Chris Brown. Alive. I want some hits that's gonna last. Alive. I want it. 
Dirk or Young Boy? Uh, even though I, I know I'm, I'm, I'm damn near kind of proud for saying both of them right now in this situation, but it's okay because they're both talented. They're both talented. They're both great artists. And, yeah, okay. and then no, in Houston, I'll take Kenny Lou. I know he was going to say. Man, that's crazy, man. Long, man, it's crazy. We lost so many great artists, man. It's Before just... they can even just blow up in the whole world, on. Yeah. yeah. I only say that because he from South Park. And I, I was jamming him for sure. And, the, and he was putting on for the whole. No, he wasn't. Yeah, for the whole South Side. For definitely, bro, definitely, bro. No, man, it's man. not even no, no gang gang. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it's love just love for some him. love for him. He, yeah. he got he, he, he he everybody. everybody like yeah, that. definitely, okay. bro. Everybody, everybody. He, How big was his influence on that side? Because me being from the North, it's hard for us to catch a whole wave of everybody. And, you know, we country and this and that. But Shit, he was I, out here too. Yeah, he was fucking with him. Yeah. I, 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 I was uh, I was driving somewhere, like, I want to say, was, was that like Greenspoon or somewhere? Like somewhere over there? Okay. Like, bro, I'm talking about, I see you. Man, y'all make sure y'all tap in. Anybody y'all want to send some last minute love to? Shout outs? Man, I want to shout out all my. The real supporters for one. Shout out Everybody to the SIP 151, you hear me? Mm hmm. I just want to give a shout out to the ones that actually fuck with FWRS and fuck with me as an artist, period. Nah, for you real. Feel me? Because all the, all the love that we getting right now for this song is crazy and it's, and it's, it's mind blowing. It's, it's a like thank you. You know what I'm saying? It's a thank you. And it's more, more music to come. I just, so I just want to give a shout out to them people. Yeah. Are y'all surprised by the love? Yeah. Yeah, yeah okay. definitely. Okay. In a yeah. year where y'all see y'all stuff, man, cause the shit gonna go fast. Y'all get the visuals and shit out. In a year, I ain't gonna lie to you. I need a, I, I need a new car. Okay. <laughs> That's why I see myself in a year. I see myself in a house and in the car, and yeah. we still doing the shit that we need to. Cause in a year, same for instance, if this song do blow, but something happened, mm -hmm. you know, we might not, we might not really just. Get that exposure that we need. This could be all the exposure we get right now. You know what I'm saying? It, everything can change. Nah, this ain't gonna be it. We gonna push y'all, man. But I mm -hmm. get what you're saying. Yeah. But Chicken once it go up, it's, you know what I'm saying? It's up. But I hope y'all stay together because a lot of groups break up and yeah. diss each other and mm -hmm. fuck that nigga. So, you know what I'm saying? I hope y'all can keep that on a good level, man. Any last minute shout outs? I want you to phone. Uh, that one five one dot train underscore and original phone key original or one five one I know for real. That's what you know. Uh, y u n g, the number two e u c e. Man, y'all go tap the fuck in, man. I'm a Plug mine up. right here. You feel me? DJ has two real mine is D E J A and it's uh dot I Z. You feel me? It's my man. It's my name. Man, and how did you get your name? You got us unique, man. Talk about it real, real quick. Oh yeah, so uh, the Jazz is really my middle name. I just decided to to oh. use it. This is my real name is Denisha the Jazz Thomas. So I decided to just use my middle name and put too real at the end because I feel like I'm I'm too real for a lot of people these days. You Talk me? about it real quick, you man. It's a lot of shit that you can say that a piss a person off, but it's just like I feel like you shouldn't should have called a motherfucker. I'm grown, ain't no point in me shooting cuz shit, you feel me? So, boom, I just, that's how I came up with my name, the Jester Real. Nah, for real, this. this uh...